uh, yeah, sure thing. I'll send that to you now. You're gonna miss me. This is it. To the airport? Uh, just to go to the airport, we'll figure out the path we want to there. This is Captain Matthew Jennings. Uh, in the cab today we have uh, Raul, who's the cabin manager, and uh, we also have uh, Chloe, Eugenio. <laughs> ah, no, stop it. So, currently trying to find the bus. Mm. <laughs> He's already walked up here. <laughs> Scaring really well. So, how do you feel about being in Barcelona? Very excited. Can't wait to get in the list and kick some butt. Oh hopefully. yeah. What? How's it going? It's cold. No. He, didn't, he didn't have his TV face on, hang on. It's cold one with just two different types of eyebrows. <laughs> <laughs> Scary, isn't it? <laughs> so, Dan, what, what are you enjoying here? <laughs> what is this, Dan? A cheesecake. Oh my god, it's cold. <laughs> it's literally the most, most dysfunctional fucking family trip ever, isn't it? <laughs> what are you using to cut it? Can I eat? Is anyone else want a cheesecake? Go on, I'll have a square. Oh my. You are giving. Let me get my hat on. And then, uh... <laughs> That is so perfect. They just don't do it for me. Do you used to wear them still? I mean, I've not come across them actually, I've just seen them on pictures. Much time. If anyone's going to be awake, just can't get over your hair. <laughs> Why not? Or I'm worth your non hair. <laughs> And then yeah. Dan shielding himself. <laughs> so many steps. Oh, so many steps. I was going to say between the bones. Why did the birds only shit on the end of it? <laughs> that's, that's where they sit for the basket. Yeah, really. <laughs>
I love doing this in front of people. It makes me feel really self-conscious. So we're just having a bit of a relax, wandering around some parts of Barcelona. Registration is from three o'clock today. So we'll be heading back to the hostel to get our armor in a bit, and then we'll um, head to the ball ring. So flights tomorrow. I'll be on in the afternoon from about four o'clock. Means I uh, get to leisurely sort out my armor, and then get used to whatever heat we're in, which at the moment is fairly nice, but um, am I going to get cooking in that armour? No, I thought I was going to go for it again. <laughs> I missed the best one. There you go. I'm wondering why you aren't coming down. Segways. Nothing happening Segways over here, police. Nothing they happening. They will. No, no, nothing. Americans. Nothing happening. We're here for weapons checks. It's, uh, it's a weird feeling. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So, they're still putting up the lists from what I can see in, in the arena. There's so many warriors here. They're everywhere. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> How do we end up at the back of the queue? God damn it, guys. <laughs> For the rise up the stairs. Oh yeah! Wow. <sighs> All right. Gonna be there tomorrow. So guys, how you feeling? <laughs> <laughs> Very articulate. <laughs> Ed, yeah. how you feeling? Excited. Can't wait. I, I've literally... Barnsley. <laughs> and what do you feel about being in the uh, Toreadoro ring? <laughs> Little bit excited. I'm very excited. Oh, jolly good. So, sitting in the ball ring. Monumental ball ring. And it's all become very real. overcome with shock and awe. I've been with the UK Veg and fighting for only seven months and I'm now at the World Championships. This is it. It's really surreal. I can't just... I can't believe I'm here. Tomorrow I'm going to be fighting in one of those lists. <laughs> the egg hits fight, but which one will win? <laughs> you saw it coming. You knew where it was going. You gave him an out. You gave him an opportunity to leave it alone. And you're like, there you go. There's your out. And it's him. Normal. Normal. Normal.